major event in the civil rights movement occurred in Oklahoma City 50 years ago, a time when blacks were refused service at stores across the city because of the color of their skin. On August 19, 1958, Clara Looper led 14 members of the NAACP Youth Council to the lunch counter at the Katz Drug Store in downtown Oklahoma City. Segregation was the rule across the state and in Oklahoma City. Blacks were not served at lunch counters, restaurants, or cafeterias. The Katz Drug Store was their first stop. The next day, the store manager announced that the company had changed their policy and blacks would be served at their lunch counter. The marchers moved on to the John A. Brown Department Store and the Crest Store. After four days of sit-ins at the Crest Store, the children were finally served at the soda fountain, but they were served on a stand-up basis. The stools at the counter had been removed, so their only option was to stand up while they were being served. When it was over, Clara Looper talked about what had been accomplished. I would like to go through some facts with you. Oklahoma has always been a leader in the field of human relations. And the battle field, the civil rights battle field has been fought here in Oklahoma and we have taken more cases to the Supreme Court than any other state in the history of America. And we have been able to do it because of the fact that the whites and colors have worked together. These were the first sit-ins held anywhere in the country by a group from the NAACP. Over the next four years, similar sit-ins would be held in a number of cities, mainly in the South. Many of them turned violent. But the Oklahoma City sit-ins were non-violent, and they accomplished their purpose. <laughs>